Bridge Constructor, only just downloaded. First thing, down here in the bottom right, turn off that racket. There's a new game button which just asks you if you want to erase all the progress you've made, which, when you've just installed it, is none. So there's no need to click that, you just click play. You need to build a lot of bridges. You start here. Slope Mania, I have no idea. Start in Westlands. Start with that bridge. Yes, the road starts out here in the middle of the ocean and you need to connect it to the rest of the world. Not, you know, the f most important one here for us. Just build a little bridge. 20 meters. Yeah, basically it's armadillo run. Uh, the only material available at the start is wood. Um, you know, it's even telling you how to build it. Well, I'm not going to build it up that way. I'm going to build it down this way, just to be weird. Because anybody... Anybody can go over the top. Let's try that. You actually have to choose a vehicle to uh, to test it with. Test it with a car, even test it with heavy trucks. Yeah, test it with cars. I'm not seeing an issue with this bridge. I think it works just fine that way up. And yeah, you know, it doesn't spoil the view of the ocean as much that way up. Smart Alec. Hang on, actually, um, back. Go to there. Go to that one. Because I didn't. Well, yeah, that is exactly what I'm doing. But I didn't test it with trucks. Because it's giving me more points. Does it actually stress out any of the members? Slightly. They're not quite as green now. Yeah! Now that's a better score because I tested it with a truck. You have to use retry to test it with trucks. Okay. Bridge two, 30 meters. Ooh. Still only wood. It's still armadillo run. I don't want to build the bridge with those lines. It's, it's telling me how to build the bridge. Blue arrows appear, drag. Click and hold, blue arrows appear, drag. Put one there, put one there, put one there, put one there. Test it. With truck, straight away. Wood's actually stronger in compression than tension, so it's probably better that way up. But Proof truck. Yes, my bridge was proof truck. What I'll do is... Oh. Yes, drag it a little at a time because arse. Apparently it doesn't let me do that. Fine. And do the same upside down design as before. And test that with trucks. We. We didn't even change it. This, this tension here isn't from the trucks, it's just from the structure. Yeah. And the new high score. I don't know why it's a new high score. We used the same materials as last time. Next, 50 meter span. Still just wood. Yes, yes they do. Triangles are very stable. No shit, Sherlock, that's how I got this far. Wood, the only structure available. Really? Can't just do it armadillo run style where you just say, I want one from there to... All the way to there, use as many pieces as necessary. No. Okay. So the obvious construction is that. Yeah, get off already. Everything's supported. 
anything that's on there will be compressing that and putting tension in there. When it's on there, it'll be compressing the top of that, putting tension in the bottom and compressing both of those as it moves from there to there. The compression in the top of that turns into tension. This gets compressed at the top and tense underneath. This stays compressed, tension compression there gets released. I'm not seeing a problem. Let me just set it to compress it. Crunch, straight through. Nope. Well, you can see that there's, you know, there is some stress on these members as they go past, but easy construction. Like it says in the trucks, that was fairly easy. I get the feeling I should be putting on sunglasses and taking them back off again, you know, alternating at the end of the levels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 40 meter bridge. But this time there isn't a left side support. There's only that one. So, I've still got no funny material. What the hell is this? What is that button? It's just the grid. Just whether it how it's grid. Okay. Obvious construction, step one. Straight across there. Obvious way to support it. Like that. Excuse me, but no, nothing there. That to there. Get off. This bit is the weak part. And... Right, so you can just click each place you want to end, and then right-click to stop building. It's an awful lot of shear stress across this joint. Tension in those. As you drive in here, it's pushing down on that, which is pulling that one, so it's putting tension on there and compression on that. Yeah, see what happens. We're not sure it's yeah, it's looking stressed already. Very stressed, worryingly stressed. Basically, Debbie doesn't let the heavy trucks across this because it would have broken them. Yeah. Oh, well. yeah! Yo. 60 meters with only a single support point. Concrete, indestructible. Yes, concrete has no braking strain in this game. That's wonderful, you know? I'm telling everyone, you have to deal with the fact that even steel and concrete could be destroyed, but in this game, concrete is just like adamantium. But you have to use a yellow anchor point, and I think they only go up. So I can put concrete here. And it gets white anchor points on it. And then... Hmm, well, the obvious way to do this is straight across. And then no, that's twenty two thousand. If I click there, is it changing it? No. Right. Well, so they are cheaper if you make them shorter. It's interesting. So I can actually make this bridge cheaper by doing that. We can try it. Send the car. Let's see what happens. That guy was spinning his wheels. Don't spin your wheels. Drive across smoothly. Testing a brand new bridge and you're spinning your wheels. Idiot. Yeah, it's another heavy set. Right. Yeah! Could I actually get away with removing those? Test that with cars. Asymmetric somehow. It's gonna get stressed. I wouldn't be happy driving it. No, I really wouldn't be happy. Go on, you can do it, lad. You can do it. It was a bad design, but it got the cars across so that it actually gets the points. 
Well done, but at least one element broke. Yes. Um, retry. There, there, and there, and from there to there, and from there to there to there, and right. No, it doesn't cost a duplicate. It's good. What the devil is? Get off. Right. Put that back in. And play and send trucks across. Heavy. Heavy, heavy. Not bad, you can take it. Uh, it'll fall apart by the end of the year if they keep driving trucks across it. Like this one. Yeah! Yeah, baby. Might be better with them on top rather than underneath, but I think it's cheaper that way. Is it? If I don't bother with that, if I put two up there and those up there, and I can try it and see what it costs, you know. It was 21,000, wasn't it? If I just build. Brave. Like that. Still twenty one thousand, it's the exact same co same cost. And it's not gonna be at all happy. Interesting. Let's go back to building it and Do that. Slightly more expensive. There might be a hmm. way to just move to the next bridge now. I know I've done it once, but never mind. Wood. There. Even more tension. Twenty thousand five hundred. Save five hundred dollars and put lives at risk. Well, we know cars are going to cost. Not good. That one a lot of stress. Keep going, truck. Keep going. You can make it. Ramp off that bridge. Yeah, baby. New high score because it fell apart. Brilliant. Ah, well, despite the fact it fell apart. Bridge six, 40 meters, water, no supports. But I've got yellow anchor points. And I've got cables. Which, funnily enough, don't withstand a compressive load. That's, you, you can't stand on the end of a cable, apparently. Funny, really, that. Okay, so obviously 20, 20, me 20 meter wooden bridge sections made out of 20 meter wooden planks. Twin from 20 meter tall, well, probably 50 meter tall trees. Impressive. I don't really want to do that. Right, minimum it costs 600, it's going up to 6,800. 4,200 to get that high. 5,200, 6,200, a ready fortune. Minimum height, minimum height, cables. Obvious construction, but that's at an angle, you know. Well, we can test it and see what happens. Test it. These are, these are Google driverless cars. There are no actual people being harmed on this three foot. <laughs> Send trucks. Yeah! We've got our 
that score there. But... Not what I meant. Wood. Just go to there. Go to there. Go to there. Go to there. And then... Go to there. What? That's the... Oh, right. That cable to there. Cable to there, and that cable to there. A considerably less sturdy design. But it was cheaper, so it scored higher. 45 metres. Okay, so I've built this... I've started out here at the sea. Where, and I've connected um, this very important oil terminal, or whatever it is that's important. Tourist ferry landing. Scuba diving school. By all of these things to here, this bridge out there and this bridge up here connect to what exactly? Fishing villages? Waterfront restaurants? They're only white, so I can't use concrete pillars. But they are further back. Can I do something really silly here and put wood up there? Yes, I can do wooden frames. And... I can do a wooden deck. can move these out, move that out, string cable from there to there to there, and from there to there to there, and from there to there, and from there to there. Okay, that's first, please. They definitely spin their wheels before they set off. You'd have a word with Google. Their self-driving cars are leaving rubber burn marks on my roads. This is not an issue. It's a truck. Truck one. No, neither is it. Right. Um. <laughs> okay. So that doesn't work, uh, because the cables break. Well, a cable across there doesn't help unless you can anchor the cable to a cable that goes down. But maybe... There to there. Cable there. To there. To there. And there. To there. Down to there, and move that. That's stronger in its own crazy kind of way. <laughs> that's green. That one, that's good. What the? Uh, beg your pardon, but what what happened to that truck? I need to see this again. That guy drives out. Just as he gets there, that was great. That's, that's bizarre. Okay, so that that definitely doesn't work. Hmm. All that weight on that cable is pulling down on this wooden beam. Or well, the tension in both those cables compresses these wooden columns, and that one gets compressed too much. Can I reinforce that? Nope. Let's just remove all that superstructure. 
and do this the other way. From there to there. There. To there. There. Like that. Let's try that. You know, I've got cars across before. So I couldn't settle for getting cars across. But this is a very important um, waterfront seafood restaurant. And you need to be able to get huge trucks to it. Hey, look at that. Yeah! Got trucks across without using anything but wood. That's actually an achievement. Okay. I wonder what I could do better. Put the structures underneath. Structure underneath is stronger. Can I run cables outside the stonework? Go away already. Can I? I mean, I could have done this and that and run just about anything across, but... Now, a cable to there doesn't help, does it? But a cable... across there... might. Let's just try that. Jesus. It's cheap. It's a lot cheaper than all that wooden superstructure. And it's turning awfully red in all that weight, which is compressing them and pulling on them. Cable across there would have fought that tension. Yeah! Cables at the ends would actually have um, compressed that wood, which when they went on would have meant that wood, instead of being pulled, just returned to neutral. Which could have been an improvement, but didn't need to do it. Bridge 8, 40 metres. Wood. Just wood. Oh no, I have to I have to cross the same gap using only wood. Only this time I've got no anchor points back here. Well gosh, isn't it a good job that I didn't need anchor points? One, two, three, four. This is the same thing as I just built, only shorter. Get really cheap and make it thinner. See whether it still survives. Oh, can't use um I can't use cables to tie it, so I'm going to have to use wood to tie it. Uh, it's a little more expensive. Smash. Boom. Yeah, that didn't work. Too much tension for that wood. If you make it thicker, do you actually decrease the tension in the wood? I don't know. I have an alternative idea. Yeah, I'm over budget. I am over budget and cannot do that. Okay. Do this the heavy way. Will it work, or will it just go crunch? It'll... A lot of compression on that top centre brace. Room, baby. That is an unhappy top centre brace. Try it with trucks. We've got trucks across everything else so far. Just gonna get them across this. That does not look happy at all. Oh, shit. 
Ooh, we've got one on the <laughs> There is an achievement for only one of the two making it. Let's, um... Try something... Different. Oh. Is that any stronger? Can't see why it would be. It's just having wake to there. It's just, it's just increasing the stress on that, if anything. So it's not going to make it. Oh, even that one didn't make it. it the extra one increased the stress. So. Being up there doesn't actually make it any bloody stronger, does it? Let's just... Real funny. Let's shave a little off the budget. And reduce the overall weight of the bridge by dropping it down to there. And it's the same colour, because it's not that much lighter. Might make the difference. Might actually break sooner. Apparently that did increase the stress in it. I've got one truck across. Just not all, not both of them. Alright, so it was stronger. Up there. How do I strengthen this? Brace it that way. How close? 300 over. Right, you. Down there. You. Down there. You. Down there. You there. You there. And you there. And now I'm 700 under. No. Just no. That is a walking disaster. Never mind, a driving mess. So... Wrong. Yee, no. It does give me an idea, though. Well, we know this doesn't work, but... Why wouldn't it do that? What's the matter with that? Tell me I can't build the deck at anything other than horizontal. The obvious way to make the bridge stronger, make a parabolic arc across here, put on and off ramps on it, it's super strong. So my problem is all that Is all the tension on there. So add some more weight out here, which will pull the top of it apart. That might work. Just spend those last $200 to increase the weight. Got that little bit more weight out here, which is pulling on all of this. That's tension on all those, fighting the compression there with the weight of this person going as well. So uh, that definitely doesn't work. It's nice that their engines keep working underwater. Hoping they keep blowing fresh air into the cabs underwater. Oh wait, they're, they're Google driveless, it's alright. 
That thing is breaking because it is not strong enough. <sighs> you know, that's just, just made it heavier. It hasn't really changed the amount of force involved up there. Has it? Has it, game? It's slightly cheaper than last time I got a trip across, but it's not really a success. Well, bugger. And that's the water, so I can't go down there. It breaks here, and then up there. This breaks first, because all the way pushing down there is swinging that, that way. So maybe... Be nice if it would let you go over budget and then adjust it to get back below budget. Maybe that'll work. Added more weight to the middle again, but I've got twice as many members in the part that broke first. That bit broke first. Go look. Ramping a truck like that, but it's still not going to happen. How much cheaper is it to go with the shorter members hit? Is it cheaper enough? No. No, it isn't. So I can't reinforce that end instead, for example. Can't do that. If I take that out, those aren't doing any good at all. I can do that, but then I can't afford to do that over here as well. So, you know, I can try this. Fail utterly. Boom. Survive the landing, even from that height. I don't think this water's real. It doesn't slow down so when it hits it. This is a job for cables. And also for someone with a bigger budget. Ooh, there's a thought. It's 
scary damn thought, but it's a thought. See, that stayed on the budget. And, no. It's still connected. It's still connected to the side. I mean, that's an improvement. Let's see here. Not a lot, and not a lot. The ability to scroll implies there are going to be some damn long bridges later. Okay, so... Nope. Just curious now. Is that rigid? Well, no. It's got all kinds of flex in it, hasn't it? But I'm curious as to whether it actually... Well... Oh, right. It'll do that. That was pretty. Snap. I thought we should make it out of this stuff, whatever this is. That looks tough. Okay. Right. That four-piece deck just wasn't working because the center broke. What if instead of making it four by four, I make it... Two threes and a four. That's that's increasing the weight on the sides. It's not changing the number of members in the middle. So no, frankly. What if I make it five, three, two, three, four, four, three, two, three, four. Can I get up there? I can get that far. More weight. Same elements, same strength, more weight. More hinge points. Guaranteed to fail. Right? Same problem, it's just got that in the middle. That's not going to help at all. Boom. Now, spectacular boom. Granted, that was a spectacular boom. Can I? Oh, look at that. Right. I can't afford to brace it anymore, but if I do that, I can. That's a more braced centerpiece. Will that help, or will the extra weight just kill it even sooner? The world's leading a spectacular oh, There we go, that's a spectacular Go on, you can get back on a dry line. If you jumped out at just the right moment, if this was Hollywood, you'd have made it. Ah, bollocks. Crunch. He's still driving. He was rammed the truck underwater. This did not work. Well, I added more weight to the middle, which is obviously a mistake. Basically only having one anchor point at each end, nowhere else I can fasten it, is stupid. I should be able to fasten on down here, that's, that's the problem. It's bad level design, it's nothing to do with my bridge construction skills.
that's actually cheaper. Right. Okay. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's underwater. It's it's not right obvious, but it is underwater. Right, what has that achieved? It hasn't braced that section to that section, so it has achieved nothing, but I need to strengthen that somehow. Tie it all across that one. Cables, you know, just put a cable across that, it'd really help. I've already tried this and it didn't work. Now you can put one more across there and it still breaks. It's got extra weight here. I could just give up and send two cars across and move on to the next island, but there's obviously something I need to learn to do. Trucks, how about you set off just slightly further apart? Oh man, that is... <laughs> now that is an ending for you. <laughs> Upside down in the cab, stick it out over the water. Get nice track. Look, truck, back off a bit and turn right. You can come up this slope instead. You'll make it. <sighs> nope. Unless he's incredibly lucky, but I suspect that no. Damn, man, if you... i got to see that again. Do that again. This guy. I mean, the first one makes it. Barely. But this guy? Now, see, that's not what happened last time. That's not what happened last time. And this time he's going back into the water as well. See, this is... This is getting worse. Nope. Maybe if you sent one car and one truck. Kind of special. Go on. You can do it, little car. Flying that high into the ground shouldn't stop yeah. you at all. You! <laughs> New ice car. <laughs> For that. Woo! Next. I haven't got trucks all over that one, but I have... 97%. Because I didn't get trucks across. Central mainland. Dear God. That, that scored more. 60 metres. Two obvious places. Those are white dots, not yellow. So not obvious places for concrete. Obvious places for wood. And my map is drunk. It is wandering around the screen in a drunken manner. See, this is what happens when you try to use a sniper rifle in Deus Ex. You know, it wobbles. It's not quite as bad as Deus Ex, because if you left it a minute in Deus Ex, you'd be facing the opposite direction. But, yeah. Mainland. Only wood. This deja vu. Click, click. Clunk. Can I bridge from there to that? No. Right. You 
Yeah. Solid. From there to there. That's not a deck. That's a piece of structure. Hmm. Right, this is more expensive than it might have been, maybe. Maybe I could have used one for you. But... That was obvious. Next. That, there, to there. There, to there. From there, that need to brace that. I shouldn't need to brace that at all. From there to there. To there, there, to there. And that's over budget, so no, I can't do that much bracing. Can I do that much bracing? Yes. Can I also, also do that much bracing? Yes. Do I actually need to? Well, there's one way to find out. Yeah, that needs bracing. Cards! Go for it! Risk your lives! Yes, this is perfectly safe. Yeah! Same thing, but same things across the sea. Man. Oh yeah, that had no business work. Yeah! That is going to be a very unpopular bridge. <laughs> People are going to sell new underwear at both ends of that bridge. We have cables and concrete pillars and yellow places to put them. Make the grid more detailed to build more precisely. That what that, ah, that's what that does. It halves the size of the grid, now we know. Right. Obviously, this is going to be the Golden Gate suspension bridge, so. Yeah. And that is more than half your budget. You, know, you can go all the way up here and you'll be broke. Let's, um, let's go with really short ones, which probably won't do the job. Wooden deck. Cross. Well, I'm thinking I should be able. There's, there's no anchor point back here for cables. It's all right. Concrete's indestructible. Honest, really, it is. Right. Not exactly parabolic, but it's a suspension bridge. Looking good. Straight for the tracks. Oh yeah. Tacoma Narrows. Here we come. There are absolutely no <laughs> stress issues in that bridge at all. Yeah! And it's proof truck. Didn't I just do this? Ah, we have steel. We have steel. Hmm, tough stuff and longer. Bit expensive. It's gonna be a budget question, isn't it? Because I'm sure I could build this out of... Ah, it's also quite 
toll bridge. So I could build a wooden structure up here. Quite reach that. Awesome. Ridiculous wooden structure. Room, baby. Who needs steel? It's a 17,200 budget ridiculous wooden structure. That's just like a bit more cheap than it's steel. The steel's not sustainable. Oh, what's, what's environment friendly? Yeah! Okay. We got 32,300 with a 17,200 budget. Try steel. Steel goes that far. All right. Wow, that's, that's already eaten the budget. So that is not how you do it. And no, you can't reach straight up there, but you can reach that far. So you can do that. Yeah, it's not going to work either. That looks silly to me. That really does look silly. 17,500. So I'd expect a smaller bonus. And these steel things aren't straight. That's an awful, lot of, an awful lot of compression in that one there, and an awful lot of tension there and compression in this. <laughs> and no, that isn't a new high score, because it was a higher budget. So, back to the world map. I've done that one, 32,300. Go next. All right, you can do that. Huge suspension bridge. Huge wooden bridge. Huge both. 30,000 budget could be expensive. Right. A couple of minimalist pillars. Can I, can I build steel decks? Oh, no steel. No steel in this level. Cables. So that straight wooden deck is the only deck you can build. No anchor points for cables, that's all right. No. Oh, right. You have to build these things in one go. Straight up. There, 
straight up to there. Cable, where are you going? Don't need to worry about that one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight steps. So four to the middle. So it's got to go. High grid. Down one, two, three, four. To there. Down three. Down two. Down one. Up one. Up two, up three, and up four. It's not quite parabolic because it should have a zero in the middle, but it'll do. From there, down to there. From there, down to there. From there, up to there. From there, down to there. From there, up to there. There, down to there. From there, up to there. And that'll do. Could it have been cheaper? Probably. Yes, it probably could. If 27,400. What? Got a minimum length of one or something? Right. Let's see what happens. Christ. What happens is. Seven four hundred. Can I? Make it cheaper. Like that. Those things weren't even close to breaking. I'm using s cables that are rated far higher than they need to be for this job. So... <laughs> that point is better supported than the rest of the deck. Why is that point better supported than the rest of the deck? Ramp the middle of the bridge. Bounce on the overstressed second half of the bridge. That's, that's actually tension there. They're pulling here and it's putting tension on that. That's cheaper. So it's a higher score. Yeah! Maybe this ought to go faster. Okay. Is there a way to make this cheaper again? I doubt it. I mean, I am curious to see what happens if I... Because those, that concrete very expensive. Could I make it with lower concrete legs? Could I? Do that. 27700. Is it cheaper? Not really. Will it work? No. Partly because I built it upside down. That's a significant part of the problem is that I actually built it upside down. Put the cables. Well, you can connect across the edge there. That's nice. 
cables across the bottom, and then switch to wood at the top. Twenty-seven seven hundred. Okay, so that's um, that's not a superior design. Back to the world map. What the heck? I've done that one, you know. I got trucks across. This one, seventy meet. There's a city in the background of this picture. That's an anchor point. Oh, I get pre-given one, just one, concrete pillar. Cheapest possible deck, obviously. I could use steel. Why would I use steel? Because steel can spam... No, it can't. It could if I moved it a little bit that way. Do that we would. You ought to support that bit. I can support both of those with cables. And that's my weak point. Which I can happily brace with wood. There, is that tension? Uh, yeah. Special. They, um, they didn't make it. I mean, cars would have made it. This bit here. That's under compression, obviously. What's this? Because on, nothing happening. It goes to there, he's pulling that down. The cable's swinging it this way. It's compressing that section. Compressing them, which I can put tension on there. You go across here, that's under compression. This is not a problem. So, this bit broke. Right, no, I wanted to... I don't actually know what I'm doing, I'm just kind of wibbling around with it at the moment and hoping stuff works, but... Do I need to brace that bit? I don't think I need to brace that bit at all. I can brace that, and that, and that. Can I steel brace that? Yes! That's a strong bridge. That's a really strong bridge. That's some tricks on the It's still crushing that section. There's nothing anchoring it this way. It's not giving this bit power, but... Yeah, they're across. And I'm on the bridge. Problem solved. New high score.
By the way, it's spectacular. I should leave the guy upside down hanging off the edge again, haven't I? Well, he, he, you know, he's still on the deck, he's past the water. Let's try that again, see what happens next. Yeah, I'm actually having more fun watching it go wrong than I do building the bridges. Oh, that's not gonna work. But it's still gonna launch the second truck spectacularly high into the air. It's interesting that the trucks always stay facing the right direction. The, the bridge panels and the bits of girder, you see that one's gone up river or down river, that is. this one's come this way, tumble away with the place. The trucks always stay in line, always facing the right direction. That thing is what's breaking. Because they're putting all this weight here. That's tension and tension. That's tension. That's too much pressure. Reversing into the river. No, no, backflipping into the river. Reversing, backflipping, staying where you are. I don't know. That yeah, wasn't spectacular. One more. Come on, I want, a I want another spectacular. Now I'll go back and redesign the bridge. Right. <laughs> Through part of the bridge. Not quite onto the road deck. That's not really spectacular. That is deep water. Not really spectacular, but it'll have to do. Back to editing. What can I do instead? Steel. Let's use the very strong steel. To support the edges, and the middle's going to give way. So... I'm sure wood's stronger underneath, but maybe if I just do the tall structure above them. Let's try that. And watch it go boom! Wait a minute, wh why did I put that bit there? Just didn't need that bit, did I? Maybe I did. I don't know. Let's send trucks across it, see what happens. Kinda of close to budget. Kinda of close to breaking. Is that steel suffering? Yes. Even the steel numbers are not happy with this. <laughs> Tight. Oh, hey. Yeah. a fault. Those two are a single unit with nothing binding them together. Ha! Caught you out, game. Balls. At least steel's strong. The rest of it's shit. Steel's strong.
Nope. Realist, but amusing. 